slight issue with. After these messages, we'll be right back. All right, gang, here's your opportunity to win my custom Maserati Ghibli, AKA Mossberg. All you gotta do to get entered is to buy one of my screensavers, and yes, my Maserati could be yours. The car is sitting on a custom air ride. The car has a ground effect kit, spoiler, rear window spoiler, custom wheels, and a custom wrap designed by me. All you gotta do is click the link and grab your interest today, and you could be going home with this customized Maserati Ghibli sitting on air ride. Get entered today. Let's go. Click the link in the description. What up? It's your boy Stunna Reason. I'm back with another video, man. Let's see, y'all. Look the chills like a mug, man. Y'all, that's real life goosebump chills, man. Chill bumps all over my body right now. But uh, yeah, man, I gotta uh, get outside, man. I, I can't sit in this house forever. So I gotta go ahead and get outside. I'm gonna go to Target and go get me some some drinks, some uh, water, some kombucha, probably some steaks, just some stuff to make here at the house. I'm gonna grab me some salt so that I can Make me some hot salt water and, um, you know, <sighs> try to get my throat better, kill the bacteria in my throat. But I am actually feeling a lot better than I was yesterday. I was able to actually sleep today for a while. I still got to come back and edit my video for the day, but yeah, man, it's actually a pretty nice day. A little overcast clouds, but not too bad. Today is Thursday, so it should be a little lit outside tonight. I don't know if I'm gonna go out or not because I'm lightheaded. My house is in shambles. Dishes, just everything need to be situated. But yeah, I mean, if you're watching my channel now, I know y'all real ones, man. Drop in the comments, I'm a real one because nobody else is gonna show y'all, you know, when they going through their down parts of their life. Um, like, like the way I do, you know, so vivid. I'm keeping 100 with you, you know. Um, I don't know if I'm not taking in enough nutrients or something. <sighs> Uh, some thing. I am back on protein. I fixed me some chicken early. I couldn't even eat it all. I might have to come off the fast for a little while. My joints and bones are so achy right now. Got the shivers. Lightheaded. But one thing I have been doing uh, while I can is I've been doing a lot of research on a lot of different stuff and uh, trying to go to the next level with uh, marketing and stuff like that. Um, trying to become a better marketing uh, brand ambassador and things like that so many opportunities out there guys to do different things if you just study and so much game out here so you just gotta find the right thing that fits your niche and you know go for it stuff that you like and go for it it really is that simple so i'm on that mission too i've been Trying to utilize the time while I'm sick to, to do that. Uh, and um, 
come on the back end out of this with some positive information that I can start applying and uh, making things better for me so I can build generational wealth for my family. So with that being said, oh, man, trying to get through it all, man, trying to get through it all. Guys, also, as far as the Marsberg, Maserati giveaway, we don't even have 100 people who have entered yet. We're right under 100 people as of right now when I'm making this video. So your eyes are great for getting that car if you want something special, if you want something different, if you don't want to be rolling up to events like everybody else. You want your own vibe, your own name. I actually got more ladies entered for this car than any other car that I've ever had. Any of them. More ladies. I would say 25%. I've had 25 ladies enter for this car. <clears throat> Just about 75 guys. So that lets you know that the ladies like the car. And I, I never get ladies really entering my giveaways. Hardly ever. But this one, the ladies, the ladies then stepped up and started uh, getting in on it. So that's different, man. It's just you just never know what um, a person you know attracts, you know. So <clears throat> what what type of vehicle attracts a person? So yeah, but that's that's different, man. But if the ladies like it, that's I mean something. What is that? I ate. Yeah, it is. I, I, I ate. Plus the wrap on it. Like a pro lesson. It's different. Yeah, gang. We're really about to get out of here and go uh, to Target. It's gonna be my first time out the house in like two days. <laughs> now the crazy thing is, I don't even drink milk eat cheese or dairy and I'm getting mucus coming out my 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 intestines. I mean not intestines on my chest. My body shouldn't even be producing mucus like that. But I don't know how it's happening. <laughs> but yeah, it's happening. Yeah. But I'm freezing cold and my shoulder is aching like from the muscle spasms and my lower back right here. Muscle spasms been going crazy. Just aching, 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 aching. So, but we're gonna get out of here. I'm about to go to the Target. I also got some packages that or some products I'm gonna review. I'm fucking shivering right now. Um, and um, I'm gonna show you guys what I got. Um, And uh, I'll holler at y'all in a minute, man. Man, y'all, health is wealth, man. Health is wealth, for real. All right, I'll holler at y'all in a minute, let's go. All right, gang, we made it down here with my big homie, Ocean. I gotta actually grab some out the trunk, man. I ain't seen my car in a couple days. Ah. Big ocean.
big ocean. I got my little tool kit out of here. Man, y'all. I want to give y'all like a lot of motivation and stuff right now. And the one thing I can say right now is Fighting through anything can be tough. But when you don't have your health, a lot of things really not prioritized anymore. So you, you know, if you're sick, if you're fighting a, a illness or some type of thing, Sometimes it's hard to keep focused and keep keep pushing. It is. It can be really hard. Really hard. So I'm just trying to stay motivated, man, and keep pushing. Electric Jeep. Some off-road tires. Big off roads on a hybrid. I love them hybrids in this boy. I don't even think you can go far with the hybrid on this truck. Cadillac hybrid, I believe. I think that's that Cadillac hybrid. Hurts to swallow, man, for real. <sighs> All right, gang, I gotta go and throw this tool kit in Mossberg. Trying to get out, get moving. Get my body activated, man. Can't just sit in the bed all day. Can't, I don't care how much pain I'm in. I'm gonna be in pain. Being pain walking around, getting out, getting some sun, trying to catch some fresh air and pain. Seeing things, getting inspired, getting motivated, and pain. I'm gonna sit in bed and pain. Pain ain't going away right now. It is going away a little bit, but it ain't gone. It ain't gone about the time. So, yeah. But all right, I'll, I'll, I'll let y'all in a minute. Man. All right, gang, so it was brought to my attention that there is a little slight issue with Mossberg, man, that we got to address. Y'all already know we uh, definitely gonna take care of everything, but it ain't nothing major. So we're going to actually take it back to wrap up 305 and they're going to resolve the issue. Yeah. So I already talked to them. Good people, man. Like, that's what I like. People who stand behind their work. And that's exactly what they're doing. So what's going on is this tail light, I guess, when they was taking it apart or whatever, they must have charred it and the LED that illuminates strips right here actually i guess shit loose or something so let me show you guys exactly what i'm talking about Get that 
illumination back in the slot. He's just gonna order a new one and it's gonna be resolved. So no biggie. It's not, you know, something that he knew or, you know, intentionally done. It was a mistake. And uh, yeah, my man, other than that, the car is beautiful, gorgeous. Even with that, it's gorgeous and beautiful. Bad ass ride, man. Bad ass ride. But yeah. But one of the things I've been working on is how to make better Instagram reels. And what I'm about to do is I'm about to take some shots right now and grab some footage so I can create a nice couple of Instagram reels. But yeah, that's what I'm on right now. So yeah, y'all stick around, stay tuned. I'll highlight y'all in a minute. Alright gang, so your boy Stunner Reese think I got enough shots out of the garage. I really need to take it to another location so you can really feel the whole demonstration of the pearls popping through with that sun. But I ain't gonna push it y'all. I still lightheaded as hell. I'm trying to make it through. Now I'm about to officially go to Target for real now. And uh go grab me some food. Then I gotta go back to the house and edit. Hopefully take me a little quick nap. And then I can go on the, on the other side of the bridge and go see how this Thursday is shaping up over here on South Beach. So that's my goal. That's my plan. I don't know how active I'm going to be engaging with the people, man. But I don't know. I'm going to just show y'all what I can show y'all. All right. I'll let you know. All right, gang. When I was leaving from the garage, seeing Mossberg. I bumped in the trader real till he was over in my neck of the woods, grabbing some Chipotle, yeah. And uh, it's good to see him. I met his cousin as well. They said they was about to go get on the yacht. Oh man, I'm like, I can't do nothing, brother. I, I am not in that mode right now, but it was good to see him. But uh, I'm gonna show you guys what I ended up getting. I didn't get everything I wanted, but I got most of it. So I got my organic pasture-raised eggs. I got me two different types of kombucha. These two over here. And I got two of these as well. And then I also got the salt. Then I got me some more olive waters. So, Oh no, I didn't get I didn't get this one, guys. I got this one. <laughs> My bad. I got the pink lady apple. They was, they was out of this one. The ginger lemon. Oh man. Woo. But uh yeah. But I gotta go ahead and get my video edited for the day and try to get it up. I guys, I just ain't been feeling it. It is currently 5.44 in the evening. I normally drop my video around seven, so. Probably ain't gonna go up at seven, but we are gonna see, man. But yeah, y'all stick around, stay tuned. Uh, I'll let y'all know. I'm gonna probably try to take me a nap after that. And then uh, if I get up, cut the camera back on and actually go across the bridge to South Beach or something, I'll let y'all know. All right, let's get it. Oh, I forgot one thing, guys. I was supposed to show y'all something. Yeah, I was supposed to show y'all some, actually two things. Um, and I got one more package coming too, but uh, one thing is for the lovely, lovely Mossberg. No, it's not the light. I ain't get the light as fast. But it is the Q4 badge to go back on there. Yeah, so we got that. We're going to be putting that back on. And the other thing your boy Sunnery's got. Man, it's like when you're sick, you don't even be excited about stuff like you would normally. But I'm going to show y'all what I got. basketball jersey the number one on the front blue and the gold then on the back you already know got that stun on now number one that way drop in the comments tell me if y'all like this I like it a lot came out dope to me 
All right, gang, let me go ahead and get this video edited. I'll let y'all, let's go. The next morning. All right, gang, so it's the next morning. And uh, as you guys can hear, man, my voice is still jacked up, still feeling like, mm, man, last night, I think I may have gotten two hours of sleep. Like literally, every time I went to sleep, 30 seconds later, I was up and watching TV and watching you know, how to build this, how to do this, how to do this, like trying to learn while I'm in this state of mind of uh, I can't really physically do too much, but it's been, uh, it's been painful, man, like for real. And first thing I want to say, guys, on this part of the video is that I appreciate all the comments all the love guys this video that i dropped of me when i was sick um guys you guys show so much love on that video guys it almost made me want to cry you know what i'm saying because there's some people that really really care about you out here you know all the text messages all the the love man like from the guys from back in the shy like everybody man everybody you know what i'm saying hit me up cuz oh uh, Reggie, <sighs> just everybody, man. I'm going through it. Lady X was going through it as well, y'all. Really, really bad. She had caught some type of bug or whatever. And she, uh, today when I talked to her, sounded like she was doing much, much better than yesterday. Yesterday she was like physically crying on the phone with me. That's how much pain she said she was in. And I, I feel it, man. Like. It was at one point last night, man, I was just like, man, I'm just ready to go. I'm like, for real, you know, all the stress and all of everything and every all the expectations and, you know, all the everything, you know, like I said, I got so much well-being uh, comments on the video. I also got a comment that person was telling me that... I should go back to Chicago and do a rebuild on Drac. Don't do no quick and easy rebuilds on cars that I'm gonna give away. Go do something to ski mask. And that's all fine and dandy, y'all. But I'm gonna tell you what. My partners spend lots and lots and lots of money on cars, bills every day, every month, and don't get half of it back in YouTube, not even close to half. So not even a quarter of it back on YouTube. So for y'all to tell me to go and do something that really don't make sense, I, I'll do it when I'm ready but for me, and, it, and it, I'm not taking that comment as a bad thing, trust me. Uh, shout out to the person who, who uh, brought the comment to my uh, page. I'm, trust me, I'm not taking it in a bad way. I appreciate your honesty, and I replied to him as well. Uh, but I, I just don't feel like, you know, everything ain't for everybody. I want my subscribers to fuck with me for me. Not because I build a car. Excuse me. I want y'all to know me as Thunder Reese uh, and the things that make me happy. If I'm not happy waiting on shops for a year to do stuff and I just got money tied up everywhere. Like, what? what's the fun in that? For it, the car to come out, after that, one video do good, and then after that, everything is back down to regular. Makes no sense to me. Makes no sense to me. And I also get so many people that tell me that they like the lifestyle content because it's different. 
it's different to show people like something different every day. If I were to show y'all the same exact people when I go to the beach every day, if I was to show y'all the same exact cars when I go to every show, every time, nothing different. Y'all would like like do something different at that at that point. So I'm doing stuff that's different every single day. No two days are alike. You're not gonna find a video with the same two people in the in the video every day. And the other thing about Miami that is definitely not in Chicago's benefit is the networking, the people that really want to help you and want to reach down to you and bring you up to a higher level. That's non-existent in Chicago. Just isn't. You know what I'm saying? So, you never want to be the biggest in a room, but you want to be in a room of bigger people that's trying to get you up there, you know, as well. Uh, you know, and there's a couple of people that, you know, of course, I can say who's assisting me in, in growing, and that's CJ on 32s, of course, and also uh, my brother Real to Real, Demonology, uh, you know, and a few other people. But for the most part, no amount of networking uh, have I got on a consistent basis like I have down here, like people trying to uplift me. Then somebody, you know, in the, in the comments said, everybody in Miami is shady. Had nobody has did not one shady thing to me, not one. So I, I don't get it. Nobody has given me a shady vibe because y'all watching a video and y'all doing what, you know, seeing what y'all see, doesn't make, what did y'all see on a video if somebody did me shady? Yeah. But yeah, gang, uh, today, man, we got a very rainy day. And it's actually going to be like this until tomorrow, guys. Yeah. Ain't going to change. I had to actually flip my table and stools down so that they won't get wet. You can see the cruise ships over there. Yeah. They still working on that building though. They ain't gonna stop. Rain ain't gonna stop them. But one of the most powerful comments I got yesterday that is gonna always stick with me. And I forget the subscriber's name who put this in the comments, but man, you said something that Man, it's just powerful for me. What he said was, I woke up this morning and I wasn't going to go to work this morning. But I seen your video and I got my ass dead up and went to work. I'm like, man, that's crazy. I motivated him to, you know what I'm saying, no matter what, get up, get to it, no matter what. If you're alive, if you got a fighting bone in your body, you can do it. You know what I'm saying? No matter how much pain you're in, how much, no matter how much stress you're under, no matter how much debt you're in, no matter what you're going through, you know, with your relationships, no matter what, if you feel like your back up is up against the wall, if your back up against the wall is up against the wall, so that means you got a fighting chance. You got a fighting chance. And even if you're on the ground and you got energy in your body, get your ass up. Get your ass up, man. So that was a powerful comment, guys. And I appreciate that, guys. And that's what I try to do every day with my channel. My channel is all real, guys. I do not show y'all no fake stuff. I'm not about to do anything more that I'm going to do anyway. If, guys, I'm telling y'all, if y'all only want to watch me so I can go spend all my money on cars, have them sitting up in shops for months, and me not enjoying them because they gone in shops, then it's not the channel for you. It's not. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's not the channel for you. So, 
That being said, guys, I'm sorry, man. I, I know I can't please everybody, but the one person that I have to please is me so that I can be happy with bringing all this content on a day-to-day -day basis. If I'm not happy bringing in all the content because I'm stressing over bills and this and that and this and that and money I got sitting out in the shops bullshitting me all the time, you know what I'm saying? I'm not, I'm not, what, what, what joy would I get out of doing that? Why? Why? I don't get it, guys. I don't get it. But, again, if that's the only way that you guys will follow me, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to have my times when I do car bills or, or do things to cars, but that's not my life. That's not my only thing. That's not the only thing I love. I love networking, building with people, being with people, being outside. I'm not a standoffish person. I, I, I'm a people person. I've always been. I've been throwing my own car shows. I've been promoting in clubs and everything for years. Always networking. Always talking to people, trying to grow. Yeah, so everything ain't for everybody, guys. Everything ain't for everybody. All right, y'all. So, I made me some tea. <coughs> uh, this turmeric tea. Uh, I've been Googling what's the better remedy for sore throats. And really, that's, that's really 85% of what's going on with me still. It's a sore throat. Uh, everything else, I pretty much feel like I might have did it already. I took some garlic pills this morning. I haven't took any ibuprofen this morning. But, yeah, so, some people say cold, some people say hot, but, you know, it's all really about what you prefer. Neither one they say saying, they both have pros and cons, supposedly. So, with that being said, Get me some turmeric tea. Just put some organic honey, I mean lemon in there. I am back on meat, guys. Uh, I know I also seen somebody in the comments saying that I need to get back on meat. Uh, in a sense, that, that was one of the things they were saying. But yes, I am back on meat. Uh, grass fed meats only. So. I'm doing everything I can. My progress on my stomach, oh my goodness, is coming out remarkable. Uh, and I think <laughs> this sickness actually kicked it down another level. So, but the bad thing of it is, is being sick for these days, I have not been able to move around uh, and get to the gym really burn any energy, burn any calories. It's really just been the majority of just sitting in the bed uh, trying to do networking, trying to actually do stuff in the clothing room and actually do stuff from, you know, inform you guys more about the giveaway. Um, so, yeah. So, man, we're going we gonna to get through this, guys. We're going to definitely get through this. Keep on doing what we got to do to show y'all the real. Y'all interested in phony shit? There's so many other channels y'all go to. It really is. You know, I'm gonna be 
doing nothing for me, nothing for you. I have fun like everybody else. And uh, yeah, I got real people that really, really love me. And I appreciate each and every one of them. Giveaway car has just hit 100 entrance. Finally, guys. 100. 100. Yeah, I'm saying that right. 100. <laughs> so, so, yeah. So, This, by far, is the lowest half of any, less than half of any giveaway I ever did. Any, any of them. So, <laughs> no, I'm not pulling the, the giveaway. I just wanna let y'all know, by the time y'all see this video, I have a new sale that I'm about to launch. It's going to be the last and final sale that I do on the giveaway. $100 is going to get you 10,000 entries. That's right. If you get a $100 screensaver, it's going to double your entries. Okay? Right now it's 5,000, but it's going to boost you up to 10. So, I ain't got nothing to lose. You know, so... Guys, I hope you guys understand that I am trying to, um, you know, give you guys an opportunity to win an awesome vehicle. Like, and the thing of it is, is so many people love that car. Like, every time I'm out in it, and I'm, actually, I got to go out in it today. I got to go to wrap up 305 so they can see the light, like I showed you guys in yesterday's video. Well, not in, I'm sorry, in the footage from yesterday, because it's still the same video. But like I showed y'all in the footage earlier, we, uh, we gotta go and get that light situated. The light, it looks like when they took the light out, they probably, you know, set it down or something and jarred in a little LED bulb. It's still in there lit up, but it's out of the socket to make it light up through the whole like pockets or lights right through the whole thing so that's what the issue is <clears throat> so yeah <clears throat> man rough guys rough about to take one of these ibuprofen <coughs> Somebody said in the comments, don't take too much ibuprofen. And I'm, I'm trying not to. I'm, I'm definitely spacing them out, but when I need them, I need them. Uh, also, I seen that it said throat infections to normally clear themselves up is no need for antibiotics for them. This is not something that's life threatening, typically, that. You know what I'm saying? If you don't take antibiotics, you will die. So, with that being said, I'm going to keep on taking my natural substance, garlic extract uh, pills, and try to naturally uh, get the infection to fight off the infection in my throat. And these ibuprofen ain't like extra strength or nothing. They just regular strength, so. <sighs> yeah. But yeah, gang, that's what's up. But I got another product that's going to be coming real soon. I showed y'all earlier in the video. But I got the Q4 badge. Yeah, we got that thing. We're going to be putting that on today. I gotta remember to take a little towel or something so I can wipe off the area where it's gonna be going. Um, but yeah. 
Yeah, we're gonna be going to uh, get that light situation together. And if he can't fix it, then he's just gonna order another one. Hopefully that's something that we can get within a day or two, like on a rush shipping or something. But we will see. But yeah, but it's just that outside coming on. But all right, y'all, appreciate it. Now, if you haven't, go ahead and make sure you go ahead and get entered for that thing, guys, because, guys, this is the car that you want to have. I'm telling you, it's going to be a different statement when you pull up in this thing. It really is. And you're going to have so much fun with it. All right? But, yeah, I'll holler at y'all. All right, let's go. All right, gang, so I'm still waiting on them to call me so I can bring Mossberg over there. This rain is pretty much messing up the day, guys. It's been raining all day, man. And um, they got cars that they don't want to pull out the shop because it's raining. So I understand that in order for them to work on my tail light. So kind of like in a pickle a little bit, but it's cool. We're going to get it taken care of. Um, but what I wanted to do real quick, guys, because to help somebody who may be been going through the same type of thing. I actually got some hot liquid, which is a turmeric tea with ginger. And I got some cold liquid, which is a smoothie. It's got kale, it's got blueberries, strawberries, pineapple, I believe, mango maybe, and I'm not sure what else, but it's a, it was like a fruity uh, blend, banana, but, um, and also oat milk. And uh, I'm gonna tell you guys what I think as far as, which gives me like an immediate soothing, and which, I, what I feel, uh, between the two. Let me go back to the hot real quick just so I can have a quicker comparison. As soon as you drink the hot, I feel like that little ball in my throat, that little thingy, thingy thing in the back of my throat is like touching my tongue so it's like it's annoying in this hell back there because everything is swollen but I feel like as soon as you take a sw swallow of something hot the pain pretty much goes away because you, you're focused on the, the the liquid going down and it's hot so I definitely feel like that definitely works now, does turmeric tea with no sugar, no honey, only lemon taste the best? No, it doesn't. <laughs> but, you know, if you want to stay healthy, it's not about being happy, it's about being healthy. You got two ways to eat in life, happy or healthy. So, you get, you can make that compromise, but you can't go too, too far off the beaten path. But now we're gonna try the smoothie. Smoothie definitely tastes way better. <clears throat> I feel like one of the things that I probably did wrong is over the past two weeks is I started eating Greek yogurt. Now, even though Greek yogurt is good for you, it's still dairy. So that allowed mucus to come into my body, into my chest. And now that I'm going through this little situation, it's trying to get that mucus up out of me. So I know I need some black seed oil. I need to order some. We'll see if I can find a place around here that has some. Definitely much more pleasant to, to uh, and it actually you know, you can drink that, you know, no problem. It don't give you that feel of, you know, being hot, too hot or whatever. Definitely more cooler. 
Now, in reference to what works the best, I would say if I had to go with either one of them, because I was drinking a smoothie last night before bed, and I didn't sleep very well. But when I woke up this morning, I made this, as I showed y'all, and um, I've been feeling better. <clears throat> I've been able to like, deal with everything. So, I think that between the two, definitely a hot tea is going to be the better choice between the two, because uh, I've done both. So, if you're ever going through this situation, definitely try some hot tea. And uh, with herbs, I'll make sure you... Uh, you know what I'm saying? Have it nice and hot. You know, not everybody has the willpower to not do certain things. And I'm not saying not go to the doctor if you are, are in a serious situation. But I feel like I came through this. I feel like I came through it, so. Was it better for me what I did for me? Yes, it is because antibiotics, they go in and yes, they kill all the germs and stuff like that, but they they also, you know, well, do your own research, do your own research. I ain't gonna say what they do. Uh, but the effects is normally a very, very long time. What the hell are they blowing for? They be going crazy on the horns out here sometimes. Why? Why? Right here. Right here. Right here. He's trying to wait for this car to... Dude's just an asshole. Asshole. Man was trying to pull the car around. <clears throat> Patience, man. One of the things that this world does not seem like a lot of people have patience to go through the hard times. Everybody want the quick fix. Everybody want the one simple action. Everybody want the get rich quick scheme, but nobody wants to do the work. Nobody wants to go through the struggle. Everybody want to have a nice physique and with their body. Everybody want a nice life, but there is no simple actions. There is no simple things for any of that. You have to take your life and take control of your life and put in the work with everything. Everything. Your family, your friends, your businesses, if you're working a job, you be the best. You do everything to a top tier level. And you start doing stuff as a top tier level. You know what I'm saying? It 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 carries on with the next thing. I and mean, everything that you do from that point will start being at the top level. Man, he the best. He Man, he outworked everybody. I was looking at Nick Cannon's story yesterday, right as I was trying to sleep, because I couldn't sleep really good. And he was just telling everybody, like, man, he, he outworked everybody.
He outworked everybody. He already knew when he saw a situation, he presented presented himself, he took advantage of it and, found, and stayed and made it work until he got the results he wanted. He didn't take no for an answer easy. He, you know, had, maybe he had to switch up a situation, you know what I'm saying, to overcome the objection. And some people are just naturally good at that. And some people have to work at it. But you have to make the decision. If you're going to work at it, if you're going to try. One thing I know, the only thing between a loser and a winner is one more try. One more try. Because a winner, you're going to try again. I'm going to try it 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 again. This time I'm going to tweak it a little bit, though. I'm going to refine it a little bit. I'm going to keep trying to polish my skill set. But a loser, they're going to like, ah, it didn't work. Well, on to the next. No. Be you. Do things that make you happy. Do things that make you happy. You'll never work a day in your life. And you don't have to do as much polishing on something that you love to do or that you have a passion for. You don't have to have so much polishing on that. Everybody has their own dreams and aspirations. Millian told me that she wanted to be a doctor and she wanted to help the kids. I'm so proud of my baby. She already told me that. That is such an inspiration to me <laughs> that my baby is three and she said, I want to be a doctor. I want to help the kids. I'm so proud of her, man. I FaceTime her every day, every single day. I don't care what I got going on. I, I'm going to see and talk to my daughter every single day and let her know, daddy, you're going to be back home. You're going to be seeing me soon. And I look, tell her I love her every day. Every single day. Proud of her. And I'm proud of her mom. I'm proud of Kingy. I'm proud of everything that she's accomplished. And the way that she's raising our kids. I love it. Yeah, so. But yeah, gang. I think I'm, I'm kind of growing out of just frivolously spending and my mindset is seeing way bigger things in my life than building a car and I love building cars but that's not the end goal it's not the end goal just like at one point in time I love dirt bikes <clears throat> then I got my first car then I got my first street motorcycle. Then I got into racing. Then I got into stunting. Then I got into, you know, so many things after, 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 after. And everything I do in reference to cars, I love them. Like cars is my passion. That's my, one of the things that bring me joy. But can I do without the headaches of the shops fucking me over? Absolutely. Or, you know, the false promises, the inflated rates because of certain things. Like all of it, it's just, it's, it's crazy. But for that being said, I'm gonna tell y'all something, man. Um, for all the people who, you know, think I didn't try to get my car painted, I actually, at one point in time, I don't know if y'all remember this, I took PC, Drac, and I took him half the down payment for him to paint Drac. Half for him to do the job. 
He had the car. The car sat in his garage for six, seven months. And I'm not saying anything wrong with PC because PC did not give me an exact date on when the car will be done. But I tried, tried to get it painted. You know what I'm saying? And I, I just felt like, you know, with that situation, and it's not just him. I don't need free storage. I don't need nobody to just, you know, I mean, if, if you just let me know what we got to do to get me in and get me out. Then, once again, I had another paint job lined up for this year. It was, car was supposed to go in September, October, 1st of October. I didn't get a call in reference to that for no, it was about February, so February. So that's that's five months later. Five months later, I didn't get a call in reference to that. And they're like, well, bring the car now. If I bring the car now, it's going to be, in, we already know, it's going to be in the shop for half the summer. Like, what's the enjoyment of that? What's the enjoyment of that? I don't, I, I don't know, guys. I just feel like sometimes you, so that you don't feel like you are giving your all to a game that, no matter how much work you put in it, you know, you, not to say that you, I want to be treated anybody better, but I'm, I didn't ask for no discounts or nothing from nobody. Either one. They told me a price, and that's, I said, okay. Half the money, down. Before they even had the car. So, I don't know. But yeah, again, that's what it is. But with that being said, man, I'm going to probably just close this video out. And if I do go to the other spot later, I'll just start up another video. And hopefully we can start feeling better. Tomorrow is Friday. It's supposed to rain all day and look like this all day today gloomy, cloudy, and then tomorrow it's supposed to rain all the way up until about four, four or five o'clock, and then it's supposed to you know, be dry after that, and then people going to start coming out on Friday, so we'll see. Saturday is going to be, no, wait a minute, is that Saturday? I think it might rain all day. No, today is Friday. So, yeah, it's Saturday. Today, yeah, today is Friday. So, Saturday, Saturday, I'm sorry, y'all. Today is Friday. I know I said earlier in the video, today is Thursday. No, today is Friday. So, tomorrow being Saturday, it's going to be a lot of uh, activity going on tomorrow night. Yeah, not too much stuff tonight, though, because it's going to rain. But yeah, I know all the people who came in today for a spring break is going to be pissed off. Yeah, you can't really do too much or nothing. You know what I'm saying? Because of the rain. Yeah. But yeah, just like that, man, this uh, video is over, man. I appreciate y'all guys. Don't forget. Go click the link in the description and get entered for Mossberg. $100 gets you 10,000 entries. Also, Get that Galati Black merch, man. You know what I'm saying? Get that Galati Black merch. Link is in the description for that as well. All right. But just like that, man, I'm out, man. I will see y'all on the next video. I'm starting to feel better. Energy's starting to get there. And I got to get back in this damn gym, man. Because, ooh, 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 I feel puny. <laughs> but I'm working on some shit, though. Yeah. All right. Let me get it. Yeah.
All right, gang, here's your opportunity to win my custom Maserati Ghibli, AKA Mossberg. All you gotta do to get entered is to buy one of my screensavers, and yes, my Maserati could be yours. The car is sitting on custom air ride. The car has a ground effect kit, spoiler, rear window spoiler, custom wheels, and a custom wrap designed by me. All you gotta do is click the link and grab your entries today, and you could be going home with this customized Maserati Ghibli sitting on air ride. Get entered today. Let's go. Click the link in the description. You are checking out the Galati Black Collection. It is the luxury trapper apparel. Trapper means take risk and prosper. This is a streetwear brand. This is a street fashion brand. Built for any occasions, clubs, parties. We got many different styles to choose from. Make sure you go and grab your Galati Black apparel today. Visit us at www.stunneracement.com. When y'all need streets, you want to stay dangerous. Make sure you do it with Kalani Black. Make sure you click the link in the description and grab yours today. You will be entered to win a round trip ticket and a hotel stay to hang out with Stunner Reese on New Year's Eve with any Kalani Black purchase. Valentine's Day is coming up. <laughs> yeah. That's different. Couple boat, plug it in, plug and play, super simple. Running the rats like I want them. Counting the rats like I want them. Carrots, I want them.